video on uh, things you need in your wardrobe kind of things you invest in the season for my of men's version if you haven't checked it out i'll put the video somewhere over here or as well, or as, well as i'll put the link in the description box so you can check that video after this video is done so many of you asked me uh, to do a men's skincare related video and uh, trust me guys i have no idea about how men's skin is and uh, what products really work on them and how it actually works for me the men's skin is basically the roughest skin no offense so i did a lot a lot of research before doing this video so i really wanted to help you guys with this out and yeah i'm going to share all the results what i've got from the uh, what i have did the research on so before starting this video take a couple of seconds to subscribe to my channel and also give this video a thumbs up before we start and also follow me on my social media here and let's keep in touch and you can get many more updates on my videos and on some skincare and a lot more things so without any further ado let's go like women, the CTM routine is very important, like equally important to men as well. CTM is basically cleansing, toning and moisturizing. Men are equally exposed to the pollution, dirt and other pollutants on a daily basis. Also, men tend to have more oilier and thicker skin than women. You need to use a good facial cleanser to of which goes almost for all the skin types. So basically cleansing uh, is essential to sanitize your skin and also uh, it removes the duds, the, the, the uh, dead cells. <laughs> basically that removes the dead cells. Use mild cleansers to cleanse uh, without drying it. Men are lazy to wash their face. Trust me, I've seen many men, I have a couple of men in my house and, and i'm not talking about any other particular person over here no offense cleansing also uh, removes white cell white cells white heads black heads and acne and for toning you can use a basic uh, rose water and moisturizing helps you prevent dryness dull skin and crack applying moisturizer on your face is equally important to apply moisturizer on your body that is your hands and feet so you have to apply moisturizer, thick moisturizer I should say, uh, when especially when you are going to bed. And you have to wash your face when while going to bed, that's for sure. Another thing men tend to ignore is the sunscreen. Sunscreen is not only for this girl thing guys, it's not only a girl's kind of a kit that they put sunscreen, exfoliate, toning before every makeup and stuff then they leave. Except for the makeup, the other all stuff is equally important to men as well. So you must apply a sunscreen of SPF minimum of 30. That is like, at minimum, you should have 30. So it's not that heat uh, that creates tanning, but the sun rays, it, they, they are very, very, very harsh on your skin. That actually creates the textures. They uh, damage the texture and damage the cells of your skin. Uh, apply the sunscreen uh, 15 minutes before heading out so that the sunscreen actually absorbs to the skin and make protects. Exfoliation is critical. You need it to uh, eliminate the dead cells and uh, get that glow and healthier skin. If you do not scrub your skin, your uh, pores might get filled with the dirt and actually prevents acne. Once in a week, you have to use a gentle scrub, but make sure you use a granulated one so that it actually removes the dead cell. For normal to combination skin, use a cream-based uh, scrub and for, norm for oily skin, use a gel-based scrub. And if you don't know about the skin types, there are three things guys. One is uh, dry, oily and combination. So dry is basically if your face is like very it's kind of a drought on your face like no nothing it's very dry that's dry oily is basically it's your face is like crying oil you have oil here 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 it's like oily 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 that's oily and the combination is basically you have oil only on this t-zone which is mine i have a combination skin 
Now, lip balms are not only for women. If you don't know, our lips actually age. Just go onto the mirror and look if you will see like wrinkles, fine lines on your lips. And on the go, the lips will become very dry and chapped. So men don't have this advantage of uh, having lipstick on to cover those lines and chapped lips. So using a lip balm with high SPF is recommended to be used in the mornings, like in daytimes, and use a nourishing uh, lip balm in at the nights to keep it hydrated in the morning as well as well as the night. And it's very very important guys, keep your beard clean and your moustache as well. It's perfectly fine to sport uh, this beard look, no shape number look and uh, kind of a classy vintage kind of a beard look. But you need to have this kind of a hygiene thing in your beard and stuff. Best thing is to wash your beard with a mild shampoo, like a baby shampoo or with a face wash that also works. Do not wash it so much that actually may take the natural oils from your beard and makes it look very dull. And there are many 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 beard oils and I've seen some on Nykaa as well. I'll just see if I can find it. And yeah, you can use fragrant oils that actually gives a fragrance to your beard and starch. With this, we came to an end, guys. If you like this video, give me a big thumbs up. And also, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. I don't know why I'm talking so fast. So, uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Until then, lots and lots of love. Bye!